So this next project is probably my favorite one that I created in this whole bundle. I love these little candy dishes that you can buy at Dollar Tree. Now these are located over in like the party supply section and I always like to pick up three. Groupings of three just in my opinion look so much better. So I'm gonna start by putting a layer of painter's tape on the top of each of these containers. And I'm gonna to try to make them all look the same and have the tape at about the same level. Then I'm going to spray paint everything with a flat black spray paint. Now this is going to take at least two coats. And I also turned them so they were upside down so that I didn't spray the inside of my containers. Once that has a chance to dry, I will remove the tape. And then you could do so many things with this. I'm gonna be filling it with some natural stones from Dollar Tree and then putting in three of my favorite succulents. This is so quick and easy to do and how adorable does this look sitting out on my table? So one of the questions I get asked frequently is about the centerpiece box that I use on several of my videos. So I actually wanted to create another centerpiece box with wood that I had in my garage. So I found two scrap boards that were one by six boards. Now I had to use two because that was what I had in my garage. If I would have gone out and bought them, I probably just would have had one board, but I wanted to make use out of what I had. So I took those two boards and I put them next to each other. That was going to be the base of my box. Then I found a one by two board. I use these frequently. They make really great borders. And I'm gonna measure the edges of my boards and cut out out two small pieces to go on the edge and then I'm gonna measure the front side to have two boards that are gonna go on the front and the back these boards are just the right size to make a nice little lip around my centerpiece box now before I put them together I wanted to stain all of the boards so I stained them with golden oak So for the two boards in the middle, I'm going to put them together with wood glue. I just bought a new tool, this finishing nailer I'm super excited about. This is the same one that my friend Christina, the DIY mommy used, and she told me this is the one I needed to get. So that's the one I got. She really likes this. So I'm going to take the finishing nailer and I'm going to nail in the boards on the side and then I will nail on the boards to the front and the back. Now to decorate my board, I found these really cute vases at Dollar Tree, so I picked up five of them, and I'm just going to spray them with a black spray paint. Now to fill these, I found these green sprigs at Hobby Lobby, so I'm just going to put these florals in, but really you could use any florals. And here's a look at how the centerpiece turned out. Hey guys, I'm Liz and you're watching my second DIY channel where I post daily DIY videos. You may be familiar with my main channel, Liz Fibic DIY, but I'm glad that you found me over here on my second channel. Make sure that you're subscribed so you just get notified every day when I post our daily DIY video.